Welcome to ALD Thermal Treatment Incorporated. We're located in Port Huron, Michigan, in a section of the city known as Industrial Park. We're one of the 41 world-class plants currently operating in this 275-acre park, which is located just a few miles from I-69 and I-94 interchanges, the Blue Water Bridge, Canadian Highway 402, and we're only 45 minutes north of Detroit. We're a toll heat treat service center, specializing in vacuum technologies, featuring low pressure carburizing with high pressure gas quenching processes, as well as precision gas nitriding and ferritic nitro carburizing capabilities. These processes minimize the distortion of precision manufacturer components used daily in the manufacture of automobile transmissions and engines, and as well have proven equally effective in industrial, sporting goods, energy, and aerospace applications. We're a wholly owned subsidiary of Germany's ALD Vacuum Technologies GmbH, a global leader in furnace manufacturing and technical services to the heat treating community, and a member of the engineering division of AMG NV, a global leader in the supply of critical materials. The mission of ALD Thermal Treatment Incorporated is to provide heat treat services with the highest quality and value to our customers. Our multiple facilities in North America and Germany have proven the value and merits of our technology, along with the dedicated team of production associates by providing the utmost precision and quality from our heat treat processes. Being a Tier 1 supplier to major automotive customers and Tier 2 to many others, we're experienced and intimately familiar with the rigid controls and protocols necessary to satisfy the stringent quality and delivery expectations of all our existing and future world-class customers. All incoming work is received and stored in our receiving warehouse. An inspection is performed on the incoming goods based on a predetermined sampling plan. Items inspected are piece count, evident nicks and dings, and confirmation of match between the parts and associated paperwork. Following release by quality after the incoming inspection, the parts are now ready for production. The parts are scheduled and travelers with the required production sequence are made and applied to each load. Each operation required on the traveler is scanned into and out of each operation for electronic material control purposes and process validation. All parts are processed and controlled as a load. The first production process required for all parts is a pre-wash operation. This process is required to remove all remaining oils or contaminants on the part surface, as well as loose chips or burrs, which may damage the heat treat equipment. A mild cleaning solution is used with warm deionized water to cut the oil, and a rust inhibitor is included to prevent any rust formation. A clean surface is required for the heat treat process, as any oil or contaminant can effectively mask any surface carburation applied during the process. It's therefore mandatory that gloves are required at all times when handling any parts. All parts are handled individually to prevent any damage that may otherwise occur. During this pre-wash process, the parts are removed from the customer's protective packaging and run through the washer. Parts exiting the pre-wash unit are then built to the specified load configuration to maximize the work zone of the heat treat chambers. Some parts are processed on alloy fixtures, while others on carbon fiber composite material called CFC. The use of each fixture is determined at time of product development and largely depends on the shape of the part. Items that are thin-walled and require minimal flatness distortion are best processed on CFC fixtures. Heavier cross-section parts or shafts are more appropriately processed using alloy fixtures. Depending on the part, each load is built the same way each time it's processed. Once built, the load is taken to the next operation, which is heat treatment. Based on a sequence schedule, an operator scans the traveler for the load and transfers the load from the cart to the load conveyor. The scan includes the process recipe for that part, which includes all steps needed to automatically heat treat that load. Our ALD manufactured Module Therm Heat Treat System is a technological marvel. It connects up to 12 independent vacuum treatment chambers with a transfer, an external quench chamber that moves on a rail system. The equipment is extremely flexible because it allows many different processes to be active at the same time, all of them using a common quench system. The system control logic simultaneously controls the processing of multiple different load recipes once they're scanned. Processes performed automatically are pre-oxidation, which further cleans the surface with heat as well as preheats the parts, vacuum heat treating, which can either carburize the surface or simply through harden the parts, rust preventative administer application, 
sprays a rust inhibitor that minimizes likelihood of rust if parts would be cryogen processed, which cools parts down with liquid nitrogen to as low as minus 300 degrees Fahrenheit if required to remove any retained austenite. Quenching, which uniformly rapidly cools parts using either helium or nitrogen gases. And tempering, which lowers the hardness to the desired specification for part requirements. After heat treat, some parts are required to be either shot blasted or shot peened. Each process targets a required area to either remove flash and burrs or cold work the surface. This capability is available and often desired by customers when utilizing our heat treat capabilities. All products require a post-wash process to apply a rust inhibitor that minimizes the likelihood of rust during transport and storage. During this process, the loads are packed into the customer's finished product dunnage. It's customary that the color of the packaging be differentiated from the incoming for obvious site differentiation. Typically green for preheat treated product and orange or blue for post-heat treated product. Prior to any shipment, a quality release is required that has the results and approval of the metallurgical lab. This result is from the review of all process control graphs and physical tests performed. Destructive tests are done on almost all loads and hardness checks on all. Some loads have parts checked for distortion comparisons in both the pre-heat treat condition as well as the post-heat treat condition to determine change. Macro hardness is the measurement of the hardness or resistance to penetration when a material is tested with applied loads. It's a quick and simple method of obtaining hardness of the material. ALD Thermal Treatment Incorporated will test the macro hardness of surface and core on a sampling from every heat treated load. Samples are selected strategically within each heat load in order to ensure acceptable level of hardness throughout the entire load. Sample Preparation Most loads have at least one sample pulled for destructive testing. The sample is sectioned, mounted in a resin, ground and polished to a mirror-like finish. Proper sample preparation is important to ensure the following tests are accurate. ALD Thermal Treatment Incorporated utilizes state-of-the-art automated equipment and a standardized process to produce world-class repeatable samples and results. Micro-hardness. Micro-hardness testing is a method of determining a material's hardness or resistance to penetration when test samples are very small or something using an applied load. ALD Thermal Treatment Incorporated utilizes micro-hardness to determine case depth core hardness and subsurface hardness as specified by our customers. Most loads at ALD Thermal Treatment Incorporated have at least one sample reviewed for post-heat treatment microstructure. Our lab reviews the structure to ensure desired transformation has occurred within heat treatment yielding expected and acceptable properties such as fatigue and wear resistance, hardness, and tensile strength. ALD Thermal Treatment Incorporated utilizes a gear analyzer to measure dimensional change of a component from heat treatment distortion, comparing the preheat treated sample to the post-heat treated sample. A sampling of parts within heat loads are tested and reviewed over time to check if there's been any change with the distortion level and or pattern. ALD Thermal Treatment Incorporated has utilized this data to show that our heat treatment process is stable, repeatable, and predictable offering minimal to no distortion. Following full compliance specification validation from the lab, the load is released and promptly shipped to the customer. The typical turnaround time of parts from time of arrival to final shipment is three days, and sometimes less, depending on your material and applications, we have the ability to be your single source heat treat provider. Each ALD facility is staffed with metallurgical experts that are available to perform testing to assist in both current and new product development. We are IATF Automotive, AS Aerospace, and OHSAS Environmental Certified and Compliant, and have been recognized by General Motors as a recipient of their Supplier Quality Excellence Award multiple years in a row. ALD Thermal Treatment Incorporated, the solution for superior quality vacuum heat treating services.